pilot is ready. Going down. 50 meters and hold, please. My name is Amanda Demopoulos. I'm from the USGS. I'm here with Martha Nazinski on the Okeanos Explorer. We launched the ROV this morning uh, about quarter to nine, and we have been surveying the east wall of Black Canyon. We're currently about 100 miles off the coast of Rhode Island, uh, pretty much due south. We are working up our first wall transect. Large number of corals, including huge numbers of deep sea corals, uh, probably some of the more densely populated uh, wall face that we've seen on this cruise. It looks like it's transitioning to a lightly sedimented covered uh, top. Um, among the corals that we've seen today uh, are several species that we haven't seen in other canyons. Yeah, that's our first true lapidisis. Do you see the one in the back? Yeah, it's whip, different. Whip bamboo, it's called curling. For those of you who are just joining us, maybe for the first time, you have tuned in at, at just the right time because we've just been seeing uh, just fantastic uh, colonies of corals here. Let's call it um, the coral forest. Coral forest. Um, I reckon to show that this is the first official target of the dive. Yes, I believe that's true. You got it. Coral forest. Thank you. only through exploration like this that we can get these views to really understand how these corals are distributed and how they're using this habitat. I count three egg cases. Um, you see one on each branch kind of on the tip. They're sort of this uh, brown color. You see the ophioid arms kind of coiled around the, the egg case. You can see the polyps close up as the shrimp is walking across the coral. That's really interesting to be able to see these mating pairs eating. Oh, 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 oh it's a swordfish. swordfish. Wow. That's so awesome. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> that coral has the fish. Those are scale worms um, crawling along the branch of the uh, black coral. Goodness. That is cool. That's awesome. What is it, Scott, do you think? I've never seen anything like that before. You know, I think this is really interesting. If I'm not mistaken, this is the first metallogorgia that we've seen this far north, not on a seamount. That coral represents a new family that we haven't been observing on this leg. That may be a species in a, a new family. We've had a few other specimens look similar to that that were collected in the Gulf of Mexico. So again, with all the exploration uh, that we're doing, uh, we continue to find new species for science. Quite a, a deep cut. It appears to be cut into the wall. It doesn't extend deeply into it, which again makes me think it's an anthropogenic fishing line being dragged up. Every dive so far we have seen trash. We have seen discarded fishing gear. This is a huge debris field of cup corals, um, all dead, all littering the bottom, which suggests that we probably have a good wall face in front of us. 
we've seen a lot of bamboo corals, yet we haven't seen any really even medium-sized ones or certainly not any large ones. We've seen maybe a couple of old uh, toppled over holds of bamboo corals, um, but nothing that suggests that they have been allowed to grow um, or growing for an extended period of time, i.e. that 80 to 100 years kinds of things. speculation that it might be a Greenland shark. Greenland shark? Yes. Your purple blob is Tritonia, probably a new species. <gasps> uh, a nudibranch. Wow! <laughs> a new <nice laughs> species. There used to be an egg mass. Andrea Quattrini is saying perhaps these are our fish eggs. We're seeing clear, dark rock colonized and crusted with all of these different animals. See what that's all about. Coral's age there, several hundred years old, is a conservative estimate at best. That is quite an impressive base now that we're even closer. We need to finish this shot. It's amazing that we always seem to uh, end our dives with just a fabulous image. One of these uh, spectacular corals or other organisms that we have been viewing. Thank you, ROB team and video, for all your help today in making this another successful dive.